Yo, what's up, people? What's up? What's up? This is Jonah, and I'm back, y'all, with another common sense eye opening videos. You know, um, today I'm going to talk about, you know, about, you know, about races, you know, families stick together, you know, and, you know, I'm, I'm going to talk. I'm going to talk about a lot of stuff, man, where people would now never want to hear, you know, um, you know, we got some people's out there looking for an answer. Those who, you know, who love my videos, those who, you know, and respect me and, you know, love me who I am and support me, you know, and, you know, some people want, you know, People just wanted the truth, you know. People just getting tired living their lies, you know, you know, and I'm just go ahead, just you know, going to talk about, you know, why, you know, so many races out there, like even Mexicans, white, Chinese, and Asian, and um, you know, Puerto Rican and you know, why families they stick together and why our race would never stick together. You know, I'm gonna go ahead and just share my thoughts, you know, because I know a lot of y'all people got a different types of opinions, you know, and I have an opinion myself though, because the way I look at things, I look at things differently, you know, because I'm different than everybody. So um the 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 way I look at things is man is totally different because because I'm walking with the spirit you know I'm I'm too spiritual you know I be seeing things differently with people we never seen you hear me so you know that's the way I am you know and I, I and I and I gotta be proud you know and because I want to look at things what God look at not y'all you know because y'all got a different you know type of mind you know because a lot of y'all people had the same, you know, mind thing. Don't get me wrong, though. So, the way I look at things, what God sees, though. So, um, I'm going to talk about, you know, you know, uh, why other races, you know, always stick together, you know. And and I'm just going to go ahead and just share my thoughts, all right? Now, let's start with white people. Okay, white white people, you know, families, they always stick together, you know, they got a vehicle, they got a house, everything, you know, family business, you know, and got some, you know, gentlemen, have a wife, get married, having kids only, you know, and they raise up kids together, but you never seen a white mother you know what I'm saying? You never seen a white mother have a single child. You know, you never heard, you never heard about white, white lady have a single, uh, you know, have, uh, have a child. You know, you never seen a uh, white lady as a single mom. You know what I'm talking about. But you seen most ladies out there, you know, what happened, husband. Or a boyfriend, you know, always has kids. You, you see what I'm saying? But don't get me wrong, man. But they got sing, they got some single white mothers out there. It does, though. You know, they got some single white mothers out there with with with, with three children. Okay, but what is the worst single mother in America? It's black women. Black black women's. You know, to always be the single mother. You know, you never seen black women with husband. You never seen black women with baby daddy. None of that stuff. I, you know, what I'm saying I seen a lot. I seen some black women. You know, have a have a husband and and raising them kids together. I seen some of it, but that's not even the fully a lot. You know, what I'm saying. I never seen a lot of a black women have a husband. All I see is the single mothers. It just, it just, it just really crazy. You know what I'm saying? I see number of single mothers raising their kids with no father. 
You know, that's the reason why most kids be raised up, you know, with a mess up mind because because most sons out there be raised by the mother without father. That's the reason why sons became a faggot. Most sons became a sissy and all that, you know what I mean? Don't get me wrong, you know. When they got some sons, they got some young, young kids, you know, have a single mom, be raised up to be a Jackson man as well. But you got some sons out there just, you know, just, uh, just have a single parents. He was raised by the mom to be a, 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 a faggot, you know. This is real, you know. That's the way I look at things, you know. And, but let me just go back to white folks. White folks, you know, family, they always stay together, you know, and brothers and sisters, white people, brothers and sisters, they, they get along, you know, they get along well, but they have a little issues too, but that's not even that much, you know, brothers and sisters, they always be mean to each other, but that's not even much, they still get along with each other. That, you know, that's a white race family are. They always stick together. They look out for each other. You know, daddy just picked a daughter off the school. You know what I'm saying? And they got some mothers out there, you know, and just pick up her daughter uh, at the school and take it to the doctor. You know what I mean? They take it to the show, take it to the zoo and all that stuff, though. You know what I'm saying? They, they look out for each other because they got money, you know, and... That's, you know, that's how family, that's how white race family are, you know, they stick together, you know, now they got some white families out there, separate, never get along, you know what I'm saying, some white race out there, they're doing drugs like blacks do, you know, but, you know, it's what it is though, so, now, let's start with the Mexicans, okay, now Mexicans is, is you know what I mean, Most Mexicans out there is different than white people, you know what I'm saying, but, you know, I'm not racist in the thing, you know. I got a lot of love for different races, you know what I'm saying? So, um, let me talk about Mexicans, man. Now, now let me tell you something about Mexicans, guys. Because I be around Mexican a lot. I used to have Mexican girlfriend way long time ago. Me and my baby mama were separating, you know. I used to go with a Mexican girl, you know. We've been together for at least like five years. So, um, all of a sudden, Mexican families, they stick together like white people do. They stick together. They always barbecue, they always hang out, you know, you know how dad is, they always work in the uh, destruction work, he's a hard working man, you know, it's nothing wrong with that, you know what I'm saying, and most Mexicans families, they are, you know what I mean, they are good, but they're kind of a little strict though, you know what I mean, and the Mexican food is, is kind of good, you know what I mean, you know, tacos, they're always fixing tacos, enchiladas and all that stuff, the family, their family always stick together, you know, and they got a little issues going on. You know what I mean? They got issues going on, and be arguing, fighting, fighting, and all that. But that's not even that bad at all. <laughs> you, 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 you see what I'm saying? You know, I, I've been in, I've been in their house. I've been there. You know, family is just it just you know what I mean? Just it just it just great. It just it's all right. It's, it's all right though. You know what I mean? And you know what I mean? They always hang out, you know, go to the mall and, you know what I mean? And just, just be busy. You just, just be busy. They working, you know, and, you know, and, you know, like I, like I say, her daddy, you know, my ex, uh, um, you know, daddy, they working on, um, and build that, build that houses, you know, they, they are destruction work. They're trying to get me to work with him, but, now, you know, I'm not used to that heat like Mexican do. You know, me, me, you know, but you got some feel Mexican. They love to work in the heat. You know, they, they, they want to build something. You know, they want to build a house, a hospital. They build all kind of stuff in the heat, man. But me personally, I don't work in the heat. I like to work in inside jobs. You know what I'm saying? So, um, yeah, man, you know, Mexican is all right, you know, but they got going some little problems sometimes. You know what I'm saying? And, but you never seen one of Mexican be set, set, uh, set and break their family. You never seen one of Mexican hate his own kind and start beating on kind, cussing each other out and calling names. You never seen one of family don't want to call a, 
or each other on the phone. Though they got some Mexicans do that, do the same thing that blacks do be doing. But that's not that's not even enough. That's not even that enough. Like talking about, you know, that's the way I look at things. But still, in the, the in, and I'm gonna say it, Mexicans, most Mexicans families, they are stay together. That's the way I see it, you know, in the spirit. You know, white people, they stick together, you know, and most Mexicans, they stick together, you know, and daddy raising their kids together, you know, and they got some fathers out there are strict with daughters not to not to have a boyfriend unless unless they graduate from high school and all that stuff, though, you know what I mean? And I give them a big credit about that, I understand, because the fathers is the head. You know what I mean? It is what it is. See what I'm saying? Now they got some Mexican wives out there, you know, and they don't want to control their husband. The husband is the head. You know what I'm saying? Don't, for real. I'm just telling you what I know. So it is what it is, though. So um, some of y'all say, well, JC, what about Chinese? Oh, man. Chinese? Oh. Well, be honest with you, I don't know much about Chinese, but the Chinese people, man, I believe they are stick together. It's close. Close. They stick together as family. Like brothers and sisters. Just like best friends or something. You know, brothers and sisters and cousins. They always visit each other. Visiting family members. They need each other. They always look out for each other. They are close. You know what I mean? And, you know, but I don't know much about them. I don't know what the issues are about. Some, some, some Chinese family, I never heard they be separate. I never heard about Chinese people always hating on each other, hating on family members, never calling on the phone and all that stuff, though. I ain't seen none of that, but I don't know nothing about Chinese. I wasn't hanging out with them and none of that stuff, though. But to me, is the way I look at them in my spirit, I believe Chinese kind of cool person. They're very cool, you know. But, you know, got some Chinese kind of little mean and all that, you know. So, uh, yeah, man. So, Indians... Indians, this family just stick together as well too, but I don't know nothing about Indians, you know, at all. I don't know much about Indians or Indian people, families that get together, you know, um, and, um, yeah, you know, and the, the, the most saddest people, why our race would never get along on each other? Why our race always killing each other? Why, 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 why? I'm gonna go ahead and tell you why. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hear, I'm gonna share my thoughts and I'm just go ahead and just open up your people's eyes. I'm gonna just tell you what I know. I'm just taking a stand. Why our race would never do things stuff. Why our race would never get along with all kind. Like the rest of this, uh, different races are. Why we ain't. That's, you know what I mean? See, we, we are looking for truth here, man. We are looking for truth because we, we, you never heard this message like this in church. You know what I mean? Preachers don't know, don't want to talk about this stuff, man. We need to know the truth, man. Why so many, our race, our black people, why we never get along with each other? Why are we always fussing each other? Why are we always fight? Why are we always cussing? Why this? Why this? Why that? Why, why, why? I'm going to tell you why, people. Because the curse of Cain, man. Curse of Cain, man. You know, killing. You you, you know the story about uh, Abel, Cain, you know. Cain killed his own brother, Abel. Y'all already know the story. Come on now. Y'all already know the story about Cain and Abel. You know, and this is what happened in the world. Our race always killing each other. You know, our race... They just been jealous, you know. <sighs> they been jealous. I got enemies they jealous of me all the time. Cause I'm doing video pull out the truth. You know, one of my enemies be hating on me so bad. Talk about I'm doing lies and all that stuff. They don't want they don't want to see me prosper. They don't they don't want to see me uh you know being successful. They don't want to see me uh you know to have everything, you know what I'm saying? And also they just tell um my, uh, my fiance sister and I to listen to my videos because they don't want her to hear the truth for the for themselves. You know what I'm saying? Start listening to the boy videos. It it really hurts me. You know what I'm saying? It really hurts me a lot. You know? And I said, damn man, her family is so wicked, man. They they hate they hate on me. 
they, you know what I'm saying? This, this, this the curse of Cain, man. The curse of Cain. They don't want, they don't want nobody to be so sex, <clears throat> to be so successful. They don't want to, they don't want, they don't want nobody to be a prosper, you know? And also, they got some black brothers out there be killing each other, killing innocent black people. You know what I mean? It happened on the movies. Um, you know, um, what's the name? What's the name of the movie? Y'all seen the movies, um, you know, the hood rats and all that, whatever we call it. New Jack City, you know, and Boys of the Hood, you know. You see number of black people always killing each other. Why why black people don't even thought about killing a different races instead of killing black people, man? It just you just it really sad, it just don't make no sense. But you gotta understand this people, it's it's the the curse of Cain, man. Curse of Cain be on us to killing my own kind, man. That's the curse of Cain, man. You know, and it just it's just really sad, man. You know, but now, and I'm just go ahead and talk about something else. Why our black people never get along with the family? Some of y'all, some of y'all just say to yourself, I say, well, JC, why our race would never get along with the family? Why family always hating on each other? Same thing, y'all. It's the curse of Cain. I keep telling you that. That's the curse of Cain, cause curse of Cain. They don't want, you know what I mean? They they don't want family to get in each other. Uh, they don't want to get along with each other, you know. Now, let me just let me use some uh, example. Something like you have a girlfriend, okay? And they just be hating on you about it. They hating on you because you got a new girlfriend. She's pretty, she's sexy every day. You know, your family members like your brother trying to, you know, and tell your girlfriend about your business, all that stuff that they trying to get with your girl. You know what I'm saying? That's how family are, man. It's just crazy. It's just it's it's crazy. It's real. You know, you got a girlfriend. You got a lot of going on in your life, and the rest of your family they just be hating on you. You know, they're not happy. You know why? Because they want you not to be happy, just like them. You see what I'm saying? They don't want you to be successful. They want you to be jealous, just like them, and also they want you to be down just like them they don't want you to be like them it's just ridiculous man you know and you know you try to make something on yourself you trying to get a job you trying to get a career every day and they just be hating on you about it man because they ain't got nothing like you do you know what i'm saying they, they just want you they want to pull you <clears throat> down on the earth because he was down he wanted to be down just like him, man. You don't want that, man. This is what happened to me. Every time doing videos, they not happy. They not happy, you know. And they want me not to be happy just like them. Hell no. You know what I'm saying? And that's how black people are, man. They just be hating on each other, killing each other, you know. Threatening on each other, you know. People be threatening on me. My baby and my family going to talk about Talk about they're going to they're gonna see me by myself. They say they're going to send someone to jump me and kill me. You know, I heard about uh, my baby mama, sister, old man. Talk about they're going to kill me or beat me up. Talk about I get with her sister with some stupid dumbass shit, man. That's the stupidest thing I ever heard in my life. That's some child ass shit, man. You know, that's what my baby mama were telling me about this. This dude I don't know about at all, you know. It's a black man. There's some black jealous going on, you know. So um, yeah, man, you know, it's sad, man. Why our race we never think why we never get along with each other like rest of this other races do. Why Mexican get along with their family? Why white people always get along with their family? Why Indians and Chinese is close to each other, man? Well, you know, and the answer is, you know, why it's so close, you know, and be honest with you, I don't have an answer, man, you know, they don't, they not curse. I'm just telling you what I know. They not curse, but us, we all curse because if it wasn't curse, family, we should have been get together. You see what I'm saying? I'm just sharing my thoughts. I'm just sharing my mind, man. Curse. If, oh, let me say like this. If black people would never be cursed, 
We, my family should have been stick together like Mexicans do. You know. Now, let me let me just let me um let me just tell you something else about curses. Why our race are curses? Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and just share my thoughts, and that was according to the Bible. Okay. You know the Most High Yahuwah put a curses on us, right? Because we disobey in the most high. Okay, the Bible say if you don't obey the most high God, they're gonna put the hands of the wicked. They're gonna they gonna uh give the get get heed to the wicked of 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 Esau. You know what I'm saying? If you don't obey the most high God, and God gonna hand us, us in the hands of the wicked of Esau. That was all in the Bible of uh, the Malachi chapter, okay? And what you know what I'm saying, this is what we are, man. You know, we're the when the hands of the Edomites. You see what I'm saying? And also the Bible say if you don't obey the most high God, they're gonna put a curse on uh us. It's it, you know, it's come to pass. The Bible say it come to pass, and they say gonna you know, all curses gonna be on us. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna be a slave jobs. It's gonna be a lot of fighting, a lot of stabbing. It's gonna be a lot of prostitute. It's got a lot of gays and faggots, and you know that's a this a type of curses, okay? This a different types of curses, and I'm gonna tell you more about curses: disease, AIDS, diabetic, headache. You know, um, um, mental mental disorder, um, you know, blindness and um. Um, body smell and um, you know what I mean uh, losing hair um, a period blood periods all that stuff this is a type of curses this is a type of curses man you know and that's that's what that's what the most high was saying if you don't obey in the most high God all curses gonna be on you it's gonna be overtake you it should come to pass you know, that's in the Bible say I not make things up. I'm not God. I'm not, you know, I'm a human being. I'm just, you know, I'm just a brother speaking truth and thank God for the truth. You know what I'm saying? You know, that's what we are, man. Because black people, our family, we never gonna get along with each other. Now they got some from they got some black people, they get along, but but they not always get along. They always hate on each other and fight and and murder each other. It's just sad. It's just the way the world we live in. We live in a messed up world we live in. You know what I'm saying? Now, here's another one. Females always put guy in child support. Left or right, left or right. She she get all money from him and every day, you know. And women want to be a man. Women want to be authority over man. Left or right, you know. That's, you know what I mean? That's, that's the world we live in today. We live in a messed up world. We live in a messed up comedy today, you know. And... You know, most men's out there just, just don't want to be a mature and women's don't know how to be wise and, you know, and this, this is so sad. Ladies uh, want to get with this, this Doug, Nappy Rue, tall, hairy, dick man. And he ain't, doing, he, ain't, he ain't got nothing to do with his life. He ain't got no job. He don't have God in his life at all. Just get with this dude. And she wind up pregnant with him, and she and he start abusing her left or right every day, you know. Because most ladies out there are just making bad choices in her life, you know. And ladies, she not deserve to be loved, you know, by the by the good man. The good man trying to, the good man trying to show her love and trying to you know be in a relationship with her, but she not she not choose to be with that good man. She choose to be with the dog man. It just. You know what I mean? That's the way that's the way it is, man. You know, we're living in a messed up world, you know, because our race is curses, man. You know, we never get together, you know, and most black brothers out there and sister, we never be saved because the curse. That's why people always killing each other, fighting, murder, because because of what's going on, man. You know, so um that's all I gotta be saying, man. I'm just giving, I'm just doing my best to give y'all the answer. You know what I'm saying? Why different races, families, they always stick to each other. Why we ain't? I already give you an answer, you know? But 
Here's, a, here's another answer. Why brothers and sisters never get along? Same thing. Curse of Cain. Sister don't want to call her own brother. Brother don't want to call his own sister. They don't want to call their own niece and nephew. They don't, you know what I'm saying? They, they hating on each other. They hating his own fresh and blood, man. And I keep telling y'all, it's a curse. It's a curse. It's what it is. It's a curse. And that people are never going to get together, y'all. And that's why, that's why people, that's why all race people never get blessed by the most high. You know what I mean? It's so sad. And I'm just telling y'all the truth. I'm just taking a stand what I'm believing for. You know what I mean? So, you know what I mean? And that's all I got to be saying, man. Take heed for this message, man. I'm just going to hit y'all with some stuff, you know. And what people don't want to talk about that, you know. And that's all I got to be saying. This is Jonah, y'all. I am out. Peace.